What is up party people? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Devin. And if you're a subscriber already, I just want to take this opportunity to sincerely apologize for not having uploaded a video in quite a while. I think it's been two weeks now and I'll dive more into that at the end of the video if you're curious. For today's video, I thought it would be fun to share with you how I'm tracking my Poshmark and Mercari sales analog style. I know it's super popular for a lot of users on the platform to make Excel spreadsheets and such, and I've tried that before, but you guys know me as the pen nerd and paper freak here on YouTube, so I just kind of had to stick with my gut and I formatted something really simple and very easy to use. My goal was to create a layout that would allow me to track my daily sales as well as see my weekly totals and be able to see everything at a glance. So I wouldn't say that this layout is anything groundbreaking in terms of the setup. I tried it out last month and even though February was a short month, I did get a good sense that this could work for me. So if it worked for me, I wanted to share it with you guys and see if it could help you out too. If you're unfamiliar with Poshmark and Mercari, those are basically apps that act as reselling platforms. So I have been undergoing my, my second round of KonMari and I was obsessed with it when I first read the book a year or two ago and I picked it up again right before the new year or right at the beginning of this year and felt very inspired to declutter my space and it's good because my husband and I recently moved so there's a lot of downsizing that we needed to go through but didn't. I was having a hard time because I knew these things were in such good condition and it was really difficult for me to part with them in that regard so I thought about this old app that I had signed up for quite some time ago. I think I signed up for Poshmark maybe within the first year or two that they developed it and I started listing some of the clothes that I decided to let go of and was pleasantly surprised by the outcome. I was never like a very avid user of Poshmark. I would get motivated and list for like a full week and then a few months would go by and nothing. So last month was my full dedicated month of listing on Poshmark and eventually I started listing on Mercari and I think that this format of tracking my sales really helped me be consistent with that. I wouldn't consider myself a serious reseller but I do want to get serious about clearing out my closet and Poshmark and Mercari have been both amazing platforms that are allowing me to do that and get a little something out of it. And for that reason, I felt very compelled to share this simple yet very effective format that you guys can duplicate in your own bullet journals or planners. I mean, you don't even have to set up your own calendar. You can just pull out your pre-printed planner and start jotting down, you know, your daily sales and what you're listing and things like that. And that's it for this video. Very simple, very straightforward, and hopefully very helpful to you all. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to check out my Poshmark and Mercari, I will have it linked off in the description box below so you can shop along with me. And I just want to apologize again for being MIA here on YouTube. I have currently been going through a creative struggle, which doesn't seem like a viable excuse, but that is me being totally honest with you guys. I've had a conversation with my husband about this, just sort of feeling like I'm in a rut of what I want to create here on YouTube. And right now for me, YouTube is just that it's a creative platform and I haven't been feeling the desire to make videos. so. I'm still exploring those feelings and if you guys have suggestions for videos that you would like to see from me, please leave those in the description box below. I might be experimenting with new kinds of videos coming up and with a new upload schedule as well. So I'm thinking moving forward that I will still be uploading at least once a week. I so appreciate your patience and understanding as I sort through 
what I'm feeling right now and sort of exploring other content to share with you on my channel. Thank you so much for watching. I will be uploading next Thursday. So until then, take care.